after their blowout loss to Penn State on Saturday, the Purdue football team sits 0-5 in the Big Ten for the first time in more than 15 years. News 18's Elizabeth Rentschler reports while head football coach Danny Hope isn't concerned that he could be fired, some Boilermaker fans say it's time. Danny, with all that's gone on, are you concerned that you're going to be fired? No, I'm not concerned about that one bit, to be quite honest with you. That's the question on many Boilermaker fans' minds, and a question Purdue football head coach Danny Hope answered after the team's 34 to 9 loss against Penn State on Saturday. But while Hope feels confident he's the man for the job, the reaction on campus seems much different. Not great. We're not doing so hot. I don't think they're doing that well. So, what do you think the future is for Danny Hope? He's probably going to be gone at the end of the season. I know it's bad to say, but. Uh... He's done a few good things for Purdue football, and it might just be his time to go. Disappointment isn't just showing on Purdue fans' faces. It's reflecting in ticket sales as well. Purdue Associate Athletics Director Tom Schott says the budget set for tickets this year was $10 million, and that's a budget they're not expecting to meet. If you don't reach your goal, it's always disappointing. But, uh, again, uh, uh, we realize there are some factors that have played a part, uh, and you know, we'll reevaluate uh, when the season's over and, and hopefully do a better job to, to meet that number a year from now. Schott says they are expected to be about $900,000 short of that $10 million budget by the end of the season. So far, overall attendance is down about $2,000 per game compared to 2011. Schott says bad weather and games on holiday weekends could be a factor for low ticket sales, but he says he knows other factors do come into play. Well, it would be naive not to understand that uh, team performance uh, you know, greatly affects uh, ticket sales. But Schott says with an average attendance between 40 and 50,000 per game, he's not too concerned. He says to date, ticket sales for the IU game are at 38,000, but that's in a stadium that holds more than 62,000. Schott says he does believe ticket sales for the IU game will be more than 40,000, but he says no matter what, they're expecting much better news next season. Our goal will be to sharpen our pencil and, and get ready for 2013 uh, once we close the books on 2012. The question might be, will Danny Hope be leading that campaign? The Boilermakers face the Indiana Hoosiers for their final home game of the season on November 24th. And in case you're wondering, tickets are still available. Elizabeth Rentschler, News 18.